Sarah. I don't want you near my car again. The last time you were next to it, there was a dent in it. Jason, stop. I told you that I didn't do it. Now leave me alone. You're the one here who doesn't have a car. Don't think I didn't notice you watching it the other day. Sarah, are you all right? Do you need some help? Mind your own damn business, Dylan. Or are you gonna snitch again? You can't just pick on people because your dad owns the place. Uh, oh, but I can. See, all of this is gonna be mine anyway. And then you two are gonna be gone, which is gonna leave me more money. That's not what this is even about. It's about making the community a better place. Now quit picking on Sarah. Shut it. I will fire your ass. All right? Just like I tried last year. Only this time, I will be in control. Now, go the hell away. Besides, I didn't think you cared anyway. Go. Jason, you're just a bully. Leave her alone. The only reason why you have a job here is because my father felt sorry for the poor little girl who brought him coffee every day. Always do what is right to help people out. When it comes to bullies, your mind is your greatest weapon. Outsmart them. Yes, thank you. Let's go. You know he's gonna have it in for you now. I don't think it matters. Let me buy you a coffee. <laughs> hey, get back here! I don't need to fight you. I've already beat you. It's mind over matter. I don't mind, you don't matter. <laughs> <laughs> 